In this video, I want to talk about uh, practicing and how important it is to make sure what you're practicing is accurate. Uh, because a lot of students have come in after having, uh, say, a piece of music for a week, and they run through it a few times after they come back uh, a week later, and it's not quite 100% yet. And several times they they look at me and they ask if, you know, like, is that good enough or should I move on? And well, the answer is no because I want to make sure that they get down what they're working on. And I tell them this, and I think this is good advice for everyone out there who's learning any kind of instrument. When you're practicing, Practice like you are recording. Just imagine that what you're doing is going to go on a CD, MP3, whatever. Just think about it like you want this to be as perfect as possible because you're going to be putting it out there for thousands of people to listen to. So when you are practicing something like just a chord progression, a scale run, if you're doing metronome work, especially metronome stuff, when you're trying to increase your speed and accuracy on something, if it's not 100%, if you feel that it is not good enough to be on a CD, then don't settle for that. Keep working on it until you get it sounding good enough to go on an album. So. I hope this advice will help you in your uh, future practice. So, and it's okay to make mistakes when you're getting there. That's fine. It's going to happen. It's all part of learning. But practice like you are recording.